Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, peep game. All right, man. Um, I have to, you know, put this out there. You know, at the end of the day, once again, the Mayonnaise Nation will always show their true colors for the most part. And it's usually always anti-black or, you know, white first, fuck the rest. Now, in case you guys don't know, once again, another sign of fake outrage and double standards that go on among sports. Now, just keep in mind, a few weeks ago, Deshaun Jackson was raked across the ashes for basically what people deemed as anti-Semitic comments towards Jewish people. Now, here you have maybe a month later, and you have Ryan Christensen and this is just really disappointing because this is my team that I rooted for. But at the end of the day, I'm not cutting nobody no slack. And the Oakland A's front office will be getting a phone call from me. But here you have batting coach, if I'm not mistaken, he's one of the coaches. His name is Ryan Christensen. And here he is, basically, while they're playing the national anthem, throwing up that neo-Nazi hand gesture. And you know how the Jewish people feel about Hitler. But keep in mind, you had all these sports media outlets not only talking about Deshaun Jackson, but talking about Nick Cannon. But Nick Cannon really has no ties to sports. But here you have Ryan Christensen, who is the coach of a team that won, what, four, four World Series? A team that's in the Bay Area. And whether people believe it or not, the Oakland A's is one of the most popular teams in baseball. You can go anywhere around the country, you will see somebody wearing an Oakland A's hat. That's fact. That is fact. Real talk. Now, the Oakland A's issued a statement saying that we may have thought it no, no we know what it was of course they tried to play the it seemed or it may have been no no we know what it was it's basically the allison morris thing with the los angeles nakers and we know damn well she didn't say nakers she said something that ended with an er but it wasn't nakers and that's basically the same thing that they trying to do now people was calling for Deshaun jackson to be cut now keep in mind these same white fucks didn't call for Riley Cooper to be cut, but they called for, you know, Deshaun Jackson to be cut. So why ain't they calling for Ryan Christensen to be fired? Once again, like I say, the Mayonnaise Nation and they fake outrage. You know, I, I mean, at the end of the day, they always show what time it is with them. And like I said, should the A's fire Ryan Christensen? y'all be the judge at the very least he should be suspended he should be suspended for 10 games and then of course he gave us that oh he didn't know what he was what gesture he come on man stop it you know it's amazing how people try to insult people's intelligence and particularly black people because white people have this mentality they have the because i'm white and i say so the the white is right oh no it's not what you think no, it is what we think, and it is what we saw. But, I mean, it's clearly that hand gesture that the neo-Nazis make. But he trying to play dumb and talk about he didn't know what that meant. Man, just stop it. But that's the thing. White people still have this mentality that they can tell black people anything, and we pose to say, oh, okay, well, since you said that, it's the truth. They have this mentality, whatever I say is the gospel. You know why? Because I'm white and I say so. But we know what the dude meant. We know what it was. We know what it is. It's obvious. So at the end of the day, I'm going to be calling the Oakland A's front office. This is my hometown team. I'm a lifelong Oakland A's fan. I have several Oakland A's hats. I felt like throwing all my Oakland A's apparel in the garbage can. But 
the Oak, we should pressure the Oakland A's to suspend him. And of course, ESPN ain't talked about this story. But Max Kellerman act like he was so mad at Nick Cannon and upset with Deshaun Jackson. Okay, well, you should be just as upset with Ryan Christensen. Right? That's what I thought. This your boy Town Biz. I'm out.